in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The book of Psalm chapter 2 verse 8. Ask, I will give you all the nations. The whole earth will be yours. Ask, I will give you all the nations. The whole earth will be yours. Dear friends, when we do the inner healing, remember, and very very powerful moment very grateful moment it is our the time we were going to the to school and it is the we are searching the role models and that is shaping our life the role models that are shaping our life and surrender the into the into the Jesus hand our school days first time we went to the school days and remember the day our parents one day morning they gave a nice bath took the took us into the church got the blessing from the parish priest and coming gave a nice bath and giving the new dress and you got so excited what is a wonderful day today what is exciting day and today was something special all are happy give you a new dress think about a small child that you were there maybe age of five wearing the new uniform and having that umbrella in the month of June, the rainy season, and first time you went to the school, and small bag with the happy, along with your parents, first time you carried, even though you may not be able to remember, and invite that moment of those school days, you hand over to Jesus. Actually, when you started with excitement, when you come near to the school, you got scared. Lot of children, lot of children, the same uniform dress. You don't know what is happening. And finally, the parents hand over you, hand over you to the teachers. And you, that first day, screaming and crying happened. Screaming and crying. The full day, you got scared. That is the way your school days you have begun. And remember, surrender all that school younger days of your experiences. Sometime you left alone, you are not having the good friends, you are not able to study properly, you are not able to study properly, and you went through in the house, you are not having the proper food and you experience the poverty not having the good food and parents may not be caring for your studies all these experiences and it is affecting it's a time you are growing and many people many children sometimes get misused that is a very painful thing happen in the childhood not knowing anything about the sexual misuse and that sexual misuse is happened sometime in the younger that innocent childhood that should have might have shattered that shattered your whole your life sometime you have got severe punishment punishment unnecessary punishment and you don't know why the parents are beating maybe the because of the angry nature angry nature of the mother Maybe because of the father full of alcohol comes to the house and beating. And that is all it is uh, as a small child is, it is giving you all the turmoil your, in, into your heart, into your heart. And experiences, experiences 
this all kind of the bad experiences maybe in the childhood you experiences the sibling jealousy when you are growing and mother was giving you another birth to another child and you experienced the sibling jealousy and you felt this child is a threat threat to me so far my parents were loving me so much now mama is having another child you just started to pull the hands and legs of the other one and whenever get the left alone you started to beat the child also and the mother got angry all these experiences of sibling jealousy it is a part of life and uh, you have to invite jesus christ invite jesus christ and i remember once uh, a mother uh, mother was telling this child was having uh, for, for the child was having a powerful hatred towards the daddy hateful hatred towards the daddy and i wanted to kill him he used to carry sometime the knife also knife also and he wanted to kill this innocent child why he carries the knife and the mother was telling it is because of the family a fight and problem he thought of committing suicide and he used to tell in the heart who is there to question my husband and no one to protect me no one to save me and who is there to save me protect me that innocent child the cry of the mother because of the family fight and that is the vibration who is there that innocent child it is there and he got yes i am here i wanted to teach a lesson to the daddy now it is unknowingly unconsciously the child is developing the full of anger and full of retaliating nature towards the father the innocent child innocent child once a doctor was telling a doctor was telling and he was smoking addiction puffing out why he was puffing out it is in the childhood it is in the childhood he was severely severe the punishment he got it very uh, very painful the root very painful punishment he got it and he was not able to retaliate the anger anger towards the daddy i remember once a young man he was addicted to smoking he went to the, all the treatment and he is not able to do any treatment and finally after the inner healing service he was completely set free from the smoking and he was telling it is from the very childhood he was punished brutal way he was punished from the daddy and that anger it is suppressed it is suppressed he cannot raise the voice against daddy he cannot raise the hands against daddy that anger that revenge it is suppressed in this small child and what he was not able to express that anger and retaliation towards the daddy it became a reflection and deviations as a deviation in the character and he was puffing out he was puffing out that anger he was puffing out and once he did that surrender he did the inner healing that is the time he realized that suppressed emotions that anger that anger he suppressed at your at his heart it became converted and converted as a smoking habit and he invited that whole the anger he released all that emotional garbage that anger that he that as a small child he went through that pain and agony the childhood pain and agony he offered to the lord when he offered to the lord and released it now why i have to puff out no re no reason 
and he was completely set free and that is why now he became new creation that is why we have to invite jesus that at all the experience in our childhood that infancy period that school days and whatever it is happened one by one we release at the hand of god invite jesus heal my emotion heal my mind i become a new creation in jesus amen